it's gotta be clickbait. <laughs> it's gotta. Why the hell this shit? This gotta be. I'm gonna watch it anyway. This gotta be clickbait. Ain't no way in hell Fly reacts is expecting a kid, bro. <laughs> listen, Fly was a funny ass nigga. I go. I don't listen to his music. Don't. Don't talk about his music. I don't listen to it. Don't. Don't do that. But. It's gotta be clickbait. Ain't no way in hell Flight got a fucking. Let's, let's, let's see if it's real. I f Cause there's a picture, but it could be Photoshop, you feel me? Ain't no. I wish I can call this nigga right now, like your rage be doing. Let's see this shit. Okay, do Flight Crew. F T C. Flight Team Stand Up. <laughs> this nigga's funny, bro. I'm not aware. I don't really watch Flight's videos, so I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is. This is my first time watching like his. I mean his streams, sometimes, but I don't know who she is. You know, she's cute. You know, but let's see the shit real. Man. Let me guys see the style of the video. You know what I'm saying? Um, get right into it. You know what I'm saying? Not cut any corners. Not have any corny storylines or any of those little jokes that you know people just you know beat around the bush to get to. But look, man. Look at flight, man. <laughs> we are expected. As you guys see the time. No, oh, this nigga dead. No. This <laughs> you. Bro, is that real, bro? No, ain't no way it has, bro. Yo. Like, stop fucking playing with me. Ain't you like, what, 23 years old? 20, yo, you got your life situated, you feel, but. Ain't no hell. That ain't no way in hell that's real. That gotta be Prince or something, bro. <laughs> Imagine baby flight. What? Yo, that's crazy, bro. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Um, just get right into it. Dive in. What you want to talk about how it happened? Just like, whoa, whoa. I just come out. Hell yeah, nigga. Whoa, whoa. How the fuck this shit happened? Ain't no way in hell that's real, bro. Listen, I'm not. Listen, by the end of this video, I guarantee you that shit's not real. Nah, bro. Uh, first off and foremost, you already know. I'm eating that so fresh, so clean, clean olive garden. My nigga, I don't care what you eat. So fresh, so clean, clean olive garden. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Chicken Alfredo. Gotta have the side salad. Make sure you have well balanced meals out there, everybody. You know what I'm saying? Got the fresh, clean, clean lemonade. You know what I'm saying? She got the water. You know? The only water you should be drinking, either this or Fiji. Listen, nigga, I'm gonna drink. I hate when y'all say that. Yeah, I say that shit. I'm gonna drink any. I'ma drink any water I want. I drink all water. Y'all niggas be the uncle Venus for white people. This is for white people. I drink I drink any water, bro. Yeah, it tastes different, but I drink any type of water. If I'm an athlete, if I'm thirsty, I'ma drink it. Don't be telling me to drink that smart water shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Not now, paying fourteen dollars for water. Focus right now, yo. Um, just like I said, we're expecting. I it, it was even I don't even I didn't even know how we were gonna necessarily like make this uh video. You know what I'm saying? You know, this is something you don't really practice for. You know, we just, you just go ahead and do. But, um, you know, to make a long story short, uh, you, know, you know, I've you know, i got a lot of new, you know, people that found out about me this year, 2020. Yeah, I'm going to lie. He's been taking off been, you know, lately. Subscribe, um, you know, subscribe, I've been taking you know, off a lot lately. I ain't going to 18-ish at least. Um, the girl that was in my videos before called my crush, a.k.a. Miss Janet Wannick, you know what I'm saying? Um, I can definitely say, like, as a man, um, it was more than that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, definitely. Um, it was more of just, like, a thing I did for the first time, you know, in my YouTube career and just decided to take my dating and, like, relationship type of stuff, like, off the, you know, camera, you know? Yeah, that's one thing. L listen, in the future, my channel is going to take off in the future. If I keep grinding, you know, I like doing this stuff. I like doing videos i will never or i want to say never i wouldn't put my relationship public you know i like i'm a private type of guy when it comes to my relationship and the girls i speak to you know and in the future i'm gonna have a fan base now my fan base is toxic i'm not introducing y'all to the girl because y'all i like how y'all do solo and universities niggas that have toxic fan bases i'm not doing it and i'm from the 2k community so i'm gonna have some toxic niggas but I don't like having my shit public like that, you feel me? Especially on camera. Because niggas, the old oh, she made you. If it wasn't for her, 
we want to be watching you. All this nonsense. Um, it was, this is kind of like hard to describe it, you know what I'm saying? But I mean, she kind of, we both obviously know, we know what it is and everything. Um, we haven't yeah, she's like pretty. made it official yeah, or anything like that, but it's clear as day we just fuck with each other. She can't leave me alone. Wait, 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 wait. Y'all not, to, not together? Whoa, y'all not together? Y'all are grown as hell. So, okay, this is what y'all be doing, but that's what my homeboy did. Nah, he not. So y'all not together, but she really like you, you feel me? And y'all having a baby? How long y'all been talking? What is this shit? I can't leave her alone. What? <laughs> no, I can't wait till you're ready to see this so shit. So basically, that's what it was. We were just dating, you know what I'm saying, off camera. Oh, um, off camera, okay. Just because I had stopped vlogging or okay, putting videos, camera. you know, of her and everything like that. Okay, now uh, This past year, pretty much, didn't necessarily mean that she was just cut off or anything. It just, that's just what I kind of felt like I wanted to do. And two, that's just kind of yeah, the direction. Bro. Obviously, you guys have seen me taking, you know, when it comes to, like, you know, my career, you know. It's just more of just, you know, focus on, you know, the, the basketball, the, the, the music, the game. The basketball stuff just needs to stop. It, it you know, instead of just like the the the, the vlogs or girlish type of stuff, don't get it twisted. Obviously, you know now, you know what I'm saying that's back in the full effect. You know what I'm saying for good reason. You know, uh, but like I said, with the title of what the video is, I don't even know how we, you know, we would meet. This shit is real. This shit is real. Because this is like the official announcement. Yo, this shit is real, bro. Everything. I'm thinking they're clowning. Um, we're expecting. Uh, we don't know the gender yet. And how many months are you pregnant, baby girl? Two months. Three months. Three months, prego. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, we, we, we did the, the things. And, you know, obviously, I'm going to go ahead and, you know. Yo, you know, when Rage see this shit, he's going to go fucking crazy. Tired side as you know, a man again. You know, I went ahead and also did uh, the call Twitter. Cast, so Rage Twitter. You know, was curious on, oh, is it my, you know, this and that. You know, I I decided I wanted to do that out of my own, you know, little, you know, it's just you know FTC reasons, flight reasons. You know, what I'm saying peace you know, of mind. Peace of mind. You know, I'm trying not to get slapped on camera. You know. <laughs> But yeah, um, I ended up, you know, we, we did a DNA test, and as you guys see, you know, it's, I'm going to have it posted on the screen somewhere around here, probably in the middle, um, you know. I am the father, you know what I'm saying? Put your fight, man. You're so inspirational, you know what I'm saying? Comment down below right now what you guys think we're going to have. Is it going to be a boy? Probably going to be a boy. Be a girl, you know what I'm saying? Probably a girl. Anymore, probably going to be a boy. Give. Listen, if it's a boy, do not. Listen, listen, fight. Basketball stuff you do is fake. I know you can ball, nigga. I know you can do it. I look. Listen, I saw your old clips back in the day. I know you can hoop. You just doing it for the clout, acting like that, playing it for the clout. Listen, if you have a son or a daughter, they play basketball. You better teach them your real shit. Don't do the fake shit on off camera, but don't ball them out. Cause I know your I know your kids gonna play sport. I know when these kids, if it's a girl or boy, they're gonna play a sport. You're gonna put it on. You're gonna put it on them. Lit Bro. behind life, you know what I'm saying? Um, hey, look, guys, um, and also to you know, you know, put it out there too. I think I was trying to uh, finish off this word we were saying, but yeah, I just, I just felt like it was the best route, you know what I'm saying? Especially with you know being an entertainer, you know, as a whole, and being out there as a public figure, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just feel like when you put your relationships out there and anybody, you know, advice like that too, they, they, they can take it from me. I just feel like it, it, it it's gonna be more of a likely for it to go left field. You know what I'm saying? If you put it out there, yeah. you put every step of your move, you know what I'm saying? I try like to how DDG be doing that shit. Out in 2020, you know what I'm saying? Niggas still be vouching for DDG and Kennedy still to this day. It's 2020. Y'all niggas roll the fuck up. And, you know, we wasn't perfect. Don't get it twisted, but look, we're still here. You know what I'm saying? She can't get off my nuts. You know what I'm saying? I can't get off her pussy because I can't say nuts because I would sound weird and you know, I'll leave a lot of trolls for the Mm -hmm. No, that would have, that yeah, that, that would have been a viral little uh, clip right there, huh? You know, nah. <laughs> nah, we not, no more L's, you know what I'm saying, from here on out, you know what I'm saying, your man, uh, Duck Reacts, you know what I'm saying, has a kid on the way, you know, still gonna be, you know what I'm saying, same person, not gonna take, you know what I'm saying, anything away to grind or anything like that, um, but one thing I definitely also could say is that if you see my mood a little bit off, 
how can I say maybe these last like couple months, three months, careful this word, um, three months, four months, five months, whatever, or you know how long she's been pregnant. It's because you know I was just for you know the moments, not even just like this, but just for the future, you know, because I'm bringing in a new life, you know. Um, it's no longer just about me. It's no longer just about her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, it's about a whole. As long as we know he won't act like Fredo. Y'all seen how Fredo been acting? <laughs> Fredo been on his. Demon time. Yo, Fredo is... Just don't act like Fredo. Don't disrespect woman. Don't do none of that shit, bro. I guarantee you fight won't do that because Fred, you're a smart nigga. But don't be like Fredo. Fredo's an idiot. Whole nother life. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and let her, you know... Yeah, she pretty, her, bro. You know, thoughts in. Like, you know, I'm trying to get a bite of this chicken off Fredo. She about to finish her plate. You know, I ain't even have a bite yet, but it's all good. But, you know what I'm saying? You know, how you kind of feel about, you know... Having a kid and stuff like that. Um, what is it? You I ain't having no kid until I get um, married, bro. I, 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 you I you told her your peoples yet? Mm-hmm. Yeah? yeah? You know what's crazy? I'm wrong for this. You tell your mom, you? I'm going to get backlash, bro. I don't care because you know, people don't know you know how people well, feel. Well, it's like they found out because yeah. I wanted to wait for me to be like in the safe zone. Yeah, that's, that's how I felt, Hold too. Hold on, y'all. My laptop dying. So this is actually real. Wow. Um, but yeah, no, no. Continue what I was saying. Like, you know, I could, I, I wouldn't get backlash, but people would just be like, oh, like, boom, boom. Like, you should have told them before the video. But I haven't even told my my own family yet. You know what I'm saying? Um, that I'm about to have. My mom will kill my ass. I'm Three months. Kid. Kill my ass. I have a kid on the way. You know, I have. You gotta tell your family, bro. And it's just. Oh, it kill my ass. I wouldn't say it's bad, but it's just like I just didn't know how to tell. You know, my peoples, you know, because, you know, always growing up, it was just like a uh, no fly zone not to have kids growing up. You know what I'm saying? Because it was just like, you know, got to make ends meet. And it's just like, but now it's different. Because our, our family, family, y'all understand, y'all niggas, y'all young niggas, y'all 18 year olds and older are probably younger. They don't understand. Y'all parents don't want you having kids because they want you to have a financial life. Plus, they want you to live your life. And my mom had me at 21. That's young as hell, bro. She didn't want me to have no kid at 21. She wanted me to live my life and get myself situated. Then when I get my life situated, then have a kid. I'm like, his life is situated, but you know, he in his, he in his mid-20s, so he still has to live a life. But, you know, he's situated. He's financially stable. Different, you know? Um, so, you know, I, I know, I already know, you know, if, you know, mom, dad, even my sister, you know what I'm saying? Y'all watching this, they ain't gonna, they ain't gonna be mad. I think they gonna be proud of me. They gonna be happy. Um, they just probably gonna be a little bit mad I didn't tell them before. Yeah, because you posted it. a video, nigga. But honestly, if you can, if y'all watching this now, um, I just didn't know how to tell y'all because you know I didn't even know I honestly even you can clearly see I'm all over the place in this video. You know what I'm saying? There's not gonna be no editing, none of that <laughs> stuff. It's gonna be now. genuine and organic. You know what I'm saying? Um, how I feel, um, I didn't even ask you, but how I honestly feel, like I feel pretty excited. You know what I'm saying? Um, it caught me off guard. But I'm definitely, um, I'm excited. I'm excited for a new chapter added, you know, into my life. That shit crazy, bro. That is crazy. As a whole, put me in the I position. would not expect this shit to be real. For uh, our future kid and to give him, you know, the best possible life. And I was going to be there, uh, uh, boy or girl, uh, no matter what, and make sure they get the ropes right, you know. Um, and make sure they can be whatever they be possible to be whatever they want to be in life, you know? Um, and that's just the best thing I can, you know, possibly say, you know? Um, but how, how you feel? You, you know, um, nervous or? I mean, I'm excited, but I'm kind of like scared at the same time. I just want my kid to be healthy, that's all. And like live a good life, which I don't doubt, but at the same time, I feel like I could have low-key waited another year, but <laughs> yeah, another year. I don't regret anything. Um, Yo, y'all niggas know how old she is? Her mouth flats around my age, but how old is she? I guess I'm kind of happy. She likes about 22. I mean, I am happy. I'm just scared for my kid because there's a lot going on in this world. Yeah. But yeah. But I'm pretty excited. I can't wait to know what I'm going to have. Yeah. Yeah, facts. Um, Hopefully it's a girl. I had left that out, out too, honestly, because I was mad hungry. I was trying to say goodbye to Alfredo. It was crazy because I was always trying to have like a, a goal set mark for when I have um, 
you know, my first kid at like 30 years old, 32-ish. That was really my age yeah. set goal. Same with me, boy. Um, gotta, That's my age set goal now, nigga. Nigga, I just turned 24 two months ago. I'm not having kids on 30, bro. I don't know, give a damn. Not 25. You couldn't wait. <laughs> Don't even get me started, yo. Like, and he like twenty five years old. I don't even feel like you know. I ain't gonna put you, put you out there like that. She already bought uh, kitty stuff. You know what no, I'm saying? I did not. What's that stuff you got me for my birthday? You guys see this right here on the video? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Talking about I'm, what, but now nah, like, um, now nah, like always growing up, even like you know, like before, like I was doing what I'm doing now. Like I was always like, I feel like the best age to have a kid is like 30, 32, where it's you know you're not too old head of shit, you're not too you know, immature, you know yeah, what I'm saying, I'm talking, just 25 now. Uh, oh, he you know, just turned 25. Sir, um, I definitely would would have liked to, you know, waited, you know, you know, a couple more years, three to five more years, but, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, but life yeah. always hits you with twists and turns, you know what I'm saying, you always be prepared, and when it comes, when things come at you, you know what I'm saying, you gotta um, act accordingly, you know what I'm saying, and be a man in the situation, you know what I'm saying? Um, time to be responsible, time to be more um, hard, harder, harder working and more mature on certain things. You know, it's just, with this, I look at it as honestly like a blessing in disguise because it's just wanting me to push harder. You know, every little thing when it comes to now, um, when it comes to, let's say if I lose certain shit or just failing, any type of small or big failure, like, now it's hurting 10 times harder. Before it would hurt, don't get it twisted, but now it's hurting like 10, 20 times harder because we all have a kid on the way. So definitely going to push me to be the best I could possibly be. You know what I'm saying? I'm excited. Yeah, time to make a family, Jano. see this video in the future. You know what I'm saying? Because just know your daddy got your back with your fight, man. So inspirational. <laughs> what you think? What you think? Um, Some good kid names out there. You guys comment down below. Also, don't forget. Listen, if I go in that comment section, I see some booty ass kid names. I swear to God, in my life, I'm gonna kill y'all niggas. Forget what you guys think. Um, uh, our kid is gonna uh, gender wise gonna be boy or girl? He's gonna be a girl, bro. Um, you got I think else? Be a boy. He's gonna be a boy. He's kind of lit. If, it, if it's a boy, a thousand percent going to be in the NBA. Right. A thousand percent. I promise you. Like, even if. As long as you don't train them, you know, you got money, so you'll you'll get somebody to train them, you know. Like I said earlier, mm. unless you use your real flight reacts. I mean, unless you become the real flight, because that's your kid, so you're not gonna act that way like you do on camera, you know. If it's a girl, I could, I'm still gonna have that same drive, you know what I'm saying? Um, but look, boy, you're gonna be in the NBA. I'm gonna let you know you're not gonna make the same mistakes I made playing ball growing up and everything. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Mommy got you for real. No, dad got you. You know what I'm saying? Look at flight man, so inspiration, but don't get twisted. You know Probably gonna be saying? like another um Lavar Ball. Girl, girl Low wants key. to play ball. It's all good. It doesn't you know what I'm saying? Do her thing. I still don't have her mind in the right place. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and they're never gonna always feel left out. You know, never, ever, ever, ever having you know what I'm saying a father. Um, growing up, I had a father growing up, and my dad was always in my life, even though, you know, he had to, you know, work constantly and was always not around when it was, you know, needed, needed, you know, or important because he was so hardworking and so caught up with everything, but he was always there, you know what I'm saying, and never judged me for anything I did, you know, so I just have to follow the footsteps, I can't disappoint, you know what I'm saying, I can't sit up here and say that I'm not gonna, um, be 100%. I can honestly say my generation, which he's a part of my generation, our generation is going to be good parents because most of us grew up without having a father figure or a mother figure. We always, most of us grew up with one parent, but our generation are going to be good parents. You know, I'm going to be a good guy, especially us gamers, dads. We're going to be good parents, bro. Free, you know what I'm saying, and be able to give 100,000% of my time, but just know that the time I'm not there, you know what I'm saying, for, you know, my unborn so fresh and so clean, clean baby, you know what I'm saying, just know I'm working to make sure you live the best possible life, you know what I'm saying, and for everybody, you know what I'm saying, to be uh, safe and comfortable, you know what I'm saying, growing up. Look, is that a like, hole in the wall? Right there? Right? Yeah, I just, <laughs> is that a hole in the wall? Yeah, sure. fuck is yeah. that? But, I mean, one thing I can say is, like, even though me and Fly haven't been perfect, like every other couple, I mean, it's not too big, but it's like not too small either. I feel like he's really a good dude. At the end of the day, he's really supportive since day one. 
I don't know. I don't want to take too much because I'm getting. I'm already emotional as it is because I'm like already hormonal. But I just want to say like shout out to him because he's really hardworking and then he's always there for me from day one. Never came a bad moment. Um, he was excited when I told him that I was pregnant. I mean, I already seen that coming. Up. Man, she would have told me she's pregnant. I would have been like, I would have walked out, been like, delete my number, and just like walk away. Yeah, that shit crazy. That's unexpected, bro. I'm 24, bro. I, mean, I ain't trying to have no kids, bro. <laughs> hey, I'm going to be carrying these jeans. Boy or girl, I'm carrying the looks and everything. I'm going to be carrying. He's selfish. My 80%, 90%. <laughs> You're selfish. Um, no. no, but he wants me to, he wants my kids to have my jeans, but either or, I don't care. We both are good looking. I want my kids to have my jeans. I got the athletic jeans. Yeah, I mean, that part. Well, I'm trying to ask about it too, though. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean, he's good overall. Like, he's always been supportive, never turned me down. Um, Always been there for me, so I appreciate that from him. Already a good uh-huh. dad, honestly, and he's not even a dad, legitly. So I know I should expect, like, even more better from him. So, yeah. We get sweating, man. I never thought so. I I never I never like I knew he was never a bad person, but like I just never knew he was so caring. And it's crazy. And it's I'm like saying. behind cameras, y'all just don't know shit. But hey, mom and dad, you still watching this video? I know you smiling. <laughs> <laughs> See that? They talk. They talk. Yeah, when right. he laughs like that, it sounds like a um. A walrus or some shit, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Is that it, bro? I ain't trying to hear y'all. Yeah, everybody, um, <clears throat> hope this video wasn't too all, all over the place. You know what I'm saying? Um, just wow. ask for the... You're humble as fuck. What the fuck was that? I'll put in a reminder, but it's... It's I'm done. I'm done. Like, the video's too damn long, bro. But, um, congrats, Flight. I, tell me if I miss anything. I don't want to uh, ride to the whole thing, because this computer is giving me issues. Um, but congrats, Flight, on the baby. If that was me, I would probably kill myself, you know, because you're 25 years old. I'm 24. We're in the same age group. Um, but congrats, man. Have fun. Yeah, hopefully, your kid is a girl. After, I, I feel like it's gonna be a girl. But hopefully, the, the kid's good. You know, I feel like you'll be a good father and she'll be a good mother. Even though you're not perfect, like I said, nobody's perfect. But good luck. Um, just make a make a family channel. Just do it. Just just do it, nigga. Might as well. But yeah, good luck with everything. Um, we'll see the baby next year. And thanks for watching, guys. Good luck, flight. Peace.